let's prepare for the class. Initial relaxation, lie down on your back in Shavasana. Legs apart and the arms apart. Mentally scan the body from toes to the head. Let go in the body. Let go in the mind. Relax the toes. Relax the feet. Relax the legs. Relax the back. Relax the arms and the shoulders. Relax the neck muscles. Relax the head. Relax the face, releasing all the expressions from the face, letting go in the mind. And connecting with the breath. Let's take a few slow, long and deep inhalations and longer, deeper exhalations. We count on the breath. Inhaling to the count eight, abdomen expands. Exhaling to the count eight, abdomen contracts. Let's do this with a count. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Abdomen and the chest expands. Exhale, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let the abdomen contract, back pressing down, whole body sinking down. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Exhale, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Exhale, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale. Exhale. Now inhale, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms over the head and give a good stretch to the body, stretch your whole body. Release the stretch, bend the knees, turn to one side, please sit up for the prayer. Sitting up straight, keep the eyes closed, hands on the knees and chin mudra, we'll chant the prayer together. Mm. Kajananam, Utaganadi, save it on Kapi the Jambu, Pansar, Bakshukam, Uma Sutam, Shokavirasha Karanam, Namami Vigni, Shara, Pata Pankajam, Sharananam, Kumkumarak the Varnam, Mahamatim, Devi Mayura Vahanam, Rudra Sisunam, Sur Seninatam, Kuham Sadam, Sharanam, Rabate. Ya kunde nudushar har dhamra, ya shubra vastra vrta, ya vina vrta nmanit kara, ya shweta padmasana, 
या ब्रह्मा ज्योति शंकर प्रभृति भेट देव सदा पूजिता समाम पादु सरस्वती भगवती निशेष जड़िया पहाड़ ओम नम शिवाय पूर्वे सचिदानंद मूर्त निष्प्रपंचाय शांताय श्री शिवानंदाते नम श्री विष्णु देवानंदाते नम ओम सर्व मंगल मंगले शिवे सर्वाद साधिके शरणे त्रयंबके गौरी नारायणी नमोस्तुते नारायणी नमोस्तुते ओम शांति 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 ओम नम शिवाय वेलकम टू द क्लास लेट्स गेट रेडी फॉर द प्रैक्टिस Kapalabhati, deeply inhale, lengthen the back, exhale, inhale, exhale. The first round of Kapalabhati, bring the awareness to the abdomen and forcefully exhale the breath on the count of one. So get ready, inhale deeply. And begin. One do, 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 one do. One two, 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 Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. For the full breath retention, inhale a deep, long, comfortable breath. Hold the breath very gently. Keep the back straight and the shoulders roll back. Hands should be on the knees, not beyond the knees. In Chin Mudra. Relax the face, neck muscles. Slowly with control, exhale. Inhale. Exhale. The next round of Kapalabhati. Check your sitting posture before we begin. Inhale deeply and begin. One two, one two, one two, one two, 
at the third eye center or the heart center. Keep the body relaxed, back straight. Slowly, gently, exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Now we get ready for the alternate nostril breathing. So if you need to stretch the legs, do that. And then recross to a comfortable cross leg position. Maybe Artha Padmasana or Padmasana this time. <clears throat> right hand in Vishnu Mudra. Left hand in Chain Mudra. Back straight through the nostrils. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Block the right nostril with the right thumb. Left inhale, a one, a two, a three, a four. Make it a long breath in the count four. Hold the breath, close the nostrils. Right exhale, a um, one, a um, two, a um, three, a um, four, a um, five, a um, six, a um, seven, a um, eight, a complete slow exhalation. Inhale, right um, one, a um, two, a um, three, a um, four, hold the breath, close the nostrils. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath, close the nostrils. So everybody take a while, open the chest more, roll the shoulders back and down. This way you get more air in the lungs. And retention also is easier. Right exhale, on um, one, on um, two, on um, three, on um, four, on um, five, on um, six, on um, seven, on um, eight. Inhale, right on um, one, on um, two, on um, three, on um, four. Put the breath gently. Close the nostrils. Mm. 
Lifting, say, long one, long two, long three, long four, long five, long six, long seven, long eight. Inhale, lift, long one, long two, long three, long four, hold the breath, close the nostrils. Right, exhale, long one, long two, long three, long four, long five, long six, long seven, long eight. Inhale, right, long one, long two, long three, long four, retain. <coughs> Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath, close the nostrils, take a while, lift the back spine up. Roll the shoulders back and down. Relax the face, neck, head and the shoulders. Right, exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right, on one, on two, on three, on four, again gently. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, on close the nostrils. Relax the body, relax the mind. Right, exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, right, on one, on two, on three, on four, retain. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, left on one, on two, on three, on four, on the breath gently, close the nostrils. Right, exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, hold, lift that energy up by straining the spine. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, on one, on two, on three, on four. Hold the breath, this is the last round. Right exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight. Inhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, hold the breath, last retention. Left exhale, on one, on two, on three, on four, on five, on six, on seven, on eight, bring the hand down, hands on the knees and chin mudra, relax the body and take a few normal breaths.
keeping the eyes closed. Please stretch your legs and lie down in Shavasana. Arms and legs apart. Keep the eyes closed. Keep the awareness on the breath and take good rest. Relax. Take a deep breath in, bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, arms with the head, give a nice stretch to the body. Stretch your whole body, moving the toes down and then pulling the toes in, stretch, stretch, stretch and release. Bend the knees, turn to one side, please sit up and stand up. Let's give a good stretch to the body. Feet together, interlock your fingers, arms away from the body, then stretch your arms up. Come up high on the toes, stretch your body, stretch. Pull the abdomen in, stretch the sides of the waist, stretch, stretch, and release. Bring the heels down, bring the arms down, get ready for sun sanitation first round. Feet together, inhale. As you exhale, join the palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Look up. Hold the breath, left leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, in what you feel. Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward and reach up, arch back, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Left side, inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted wheel. Inhale, the left leg forward, left foot between the hands, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward. Inhale, stretch your body forward, reach up and arch back, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Stretch your chin up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted V. Inhale, the right leg forward. Right foot between the hands and look up. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch your body forward, reach up, arch back. Push the buttocks forward and look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted wave. Inhale, the left leg forward, left foot between the hands, look up. Exhale, right leg forward. 
Inhale, reach forward and reach up. Push the buttocks forward. Look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Next round. Inhale and exhale. Join the palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms apart back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back. Stay here and breathe. Push the right leg just a little more away. Opening the spine more. <clears throat> Keep the eyes closed and stretch your chin up. Try to place the hands down fully. Now take a breath. Take, tuck the right toes in and take the left leg back. Hold the flank pose. Abdomen pulled in towards the back. Align the wrist and the shoulders. Keep the head in the neutral position. Keep breathing. Slowly as you exhale, bring your knees down, chest between the hands, forehead or chin on the mat. Slide forward, inhale, large back into cobra. Relax the shoulders. Keep the elbows tucked into the chest. Exhale, tuck the toes in. Lift your buttocks and look to the toes. Let's hold the posture in what it be. Push the heels more down, hands more down. Knees straight, elbows straight. Tailbone lifted up. Push the chest down to the, towards the mat with your head in line between the arms and pull the abdomen in. Watch your breathing. Make it slow, long and deep. On the next inhalation, draw the right leg forward, place the right foot between the hands and move the left leg just a little more away. Stay breathe, stretch the chin up. Don't let the chest shrink towards the mat, lift it up, open it up. Now on the exhalation, move the left leg forward and stay in the forward bend. Try to bring the chest close to the thighs, knees bent or knees straight is fine. Forehead close to the legs, close to the knees and top of the head towards the feet. Keep the hands or the fingertips down, don't keep the hands hanging loose. As you inhale, stretch your body forward and reach up. Push the buttocks forward, a little more forward. Knee straight, elbow straight, don't drop the head back. Look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Left side, maintaining the same stretch, going a little faster. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, arms apart back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back all the way, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back into the plank. Body in a straight line, back like a tabletop. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, in V. push down and lift up. Inhale, bring the left leg forward. Left foot between the hands, look up. Exhale, the right leg forward, through the forward bend. <clears throat> Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back. Push the body all the way forward and look up. Exhale, release. Next round, inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, look up. Hold the breath, left leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, in V. <coughs> Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward and reach up. Push the buttocks forward, look up to the hands. Exhale, release. Inhale, and exhale, join the palms to the chest. Inhale, stretch your arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back into the plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, in V. 
Inhale the left leg forward. Exhale right leg forward. Inhale, stretch your body forward. Reach up and arch back. Look up. Exhale, release. Next round. Inhale and exhale, palms together to the chest. Inhale, stretch the arms up and arch back. Exhale, stretch the body forward and down. Inhale, the right leg back, to up. Hold the breath, left leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted breathe. Inhale, the right leg forward. Exhale, the left leg forward. Inhale, stretch forward, stretch up and arch back. And exhale, release. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, lumps of arch back. Exhale, stretch forward and down. Inhale, the left leg back, look up. Hold the breath, right leg back, plank. Exhale, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, inverted breathe. Inhale, the left leg forward. Exhale, the right leg forward. Stretch forward, inhale, reach up, <clears throat> arch back. Look up to the hands and exhale, release. Last round, the sixth round. Inhale and exhale, palms to the chest. Inhale, two, arms to arch back. Exhale, three, stretch forward and down. Inhale, four, the right leg back all the way. Look up. Hold the breath five, but leg back. Exhale, six, knees, chest from the forehead down. Inhale, seven, cobra. Exhale, eight, inverted breathe. Inhale, nine, the right leg forward. Exhale, ten, the other leg forward. Inhale, eleven, stretch forward, reach up and arch back. Exhale, release, twelve. Last time on the left side. Inhale and exhale. One, Pranamasan. Inhale, two, Hastutanasan. Stretch up. Exhale, three, Padastasan. Come down. Let's slow down the body. Inhale, four, the left leg back. Ashusan Chalanasan. Hold the breath, five, for the leg back. Kumbhakasan. The plank pose. Exhale, six, Ashtangasana. Ashtanga Namaskar, knees, chest and the forehead down. Inhale, seven, Bhujangasana, the cobra. Exhale, eight, inverted V. Adho Mukhshwanasana. Inhale, nine, the left leg forward, Ashusan Chalanasana. Exhale, ten, the other leg forward, Padastasana. Inhale, eleven, stretch up. Arch back, Hastutanasana, look up. Exhale, release 12, Samasthiti. Please sit down and lie down, relax on your back in Shavasana, arms apart and the legs apart. Take good rest, relax, slow down the breathing. Palm toes to the head, watch your body. And let go all the tension, all the tightness. Relax down with gravity. Just let go.
Slowly bring the legs together, take a deep breath in. Interlock your fingers, stretch your arms up, give a nice good stretch to the body, stretch the whole body. Release the stretch. Let's get ready for the single leg raises. Fix the arms close to the body, palms facing down, feet together, toes pointing up and with the chin close to the chest. Remember to work with your abdomen, not with the arms or the shoulders or the neck. Inhale, raise the right leg straight up. Push the heel out, knee straight. Exhale, bring the leg down with control. Slowly. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Right leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. Right leg inhale up, hold the right thigh with both your hands and bring the leg closer towards the body. As you exhale, raise the head up, chest up, come up, walk the hands more up towards the ankle. And you need to keep the knees straight wherever you hold. So take a while, open the eyes and watch your posture, everybody. The toes pulled in towards the head, shoulders relaxed away from the ears. Keep the elbows slightly bent. And close your eyes, stretching the chin up towards the toes. Now push the left thigh more down towards the mat. Stay and breathe. Stimulating the abdominal organs, strengthening the abdominal muscles, and strengthening the back, lower back. Stretching the hamstring. So keep the knee straight. Breathing very slow, long and deep. There is no hurry to breathe. And this is the only time that we breathe consciously. Now, those who are flexible enough, please hold the right big toe with your right hand. If you cannot, please don't worry. Put the head down, chest down, everybody. And stretch the left arm in line with the shoulder. On the exhalation, move the right leg to the right side. So those who cannot hold the toe with the knee straight, try to hold the thigh from inside or you can hold the toe and take the leg wherever possible down towards the mat. You don't have to bring it all the way down if the knee bends. Feel a good stretch in the right leg. And now you need to focus on the left, but push it more down as much as possible. Breathe. The head can be in the center or you can turn it to the left. So this is not a spinal twist that we are doing. So you can keep the head wherever you are comfortable. Now slowly raise the leg, inhale, bring the head back to the center, interchange your hands position, holding the right big toe with your left hand, stretching the right arm in line with the shoulder on the exhalation, move the right leg to the left side of your body. If you cannot hold the toe with your knee straight, please hold the outside of the right thigh with your left hand and pull the leg more up. You need to relax the right shoulder completely on the mat and relax the neck muscles. Right knee should be nicely straight. The leg is like a stick. Breathe. And remember to breathe into the abdomen slowly and deeply. Slowly release the toe hold. Raise the leg, inhale up, bring the head back to the center, arms close to the body, exhale with control, bring the leg all the way down. We'll complete the same cycle on the left side. Raise the left leg, inhale up, hold the left leg from behind, pull the leg closer towards the body. And as you exhale, raise the head, chest, come up, walk the hands more up. We'll hold the posture for a while, so we'll stay here and focus on the breath, slow breathing, deep breathing. Toes pulled in, right thigh pushing down, knee straight, relax the body, relax the shoulders. Every exhalation, the abdomen contracting and the leg moving in towards the body. Now make your own adjustment for moving the right leg, left leg to the left side. So hold the toe or just put the head down and hold the thigh from inside. 
Stretch the right arm out. On the exhalation, move the left leg to the left side. Adjust your head position. And now you focus on pushing the right body towards the mat. Keep the left knee straight wherever you hold. Focus on the breath. Slowly come up, inhale, and change the hand position. On the exhalation, move the left leg to the right side of your body. Turn the head to the left, pressing the left shoulder completely to the mat, keeping the left knee straight, and breathe into the abdomen. Feel a good twist in the spine. Slowly release the posture, take your own time, inhale, come up. Arms close to the body, with control, exhale, bring the left leg down. Now we get ready for the double leg raises. Choose your arms position under the body or by the side of the body or tuck the hands behind the head or stretch the arms over the head. So find your own way to do this practice, but work with your abdominal muscles, not with the arms or the shoulders activity. Inhale, raise both your legs straight up. Knees straight, toes pulled in, lower back down. Exhale with control, bring the legs down close to the mat. Inhale, come up. Exhale down. Third time up, inhale. Exhale down. Four up, inhale, we'll do it six times. Exhale down. Five up, inhale. Exhale down. One more time, inhale up. Now on the exhalation, first bring the legs midway down. Midway down. A little more down, yeah. Hold it here. Five, four, three, two, one. Now bring the legs close to the mat, very close to the mat, just two inches above. More down, two inches above. Two inches means two inches. Hold it, five, four, three, two, one, and slowly release the legs down. That's very good. Turn the head side to side, and then give a good stretch to the body. Bend the knees, turn over, sit up, relax in the child's pose. Preparing for the headstand practice. Shashank Asana, take a few breaths here. Please slowly sit up on the heels. Hold the opposite elbows. Place the forearms down close to the knees. Stretch your forearms forward, interlock your fingers. Place the top of the head on the mat, back of the head against the hands. Tuck the toes in, lift your knees up and walk forward. Keep walking forward, straighten the back. And then when you're ready, bend the knees to the chest. Or just one knee to the chest and alternate the legs if you're not yet ready for the headstand. Those who are up into the headstand, Please keep the abdomen tucked in and close your eyes. Still the body, relax the legs. You'll hold it for some time. Those who are trying, please keep trying. You may go against the wall or just hold with your back straight and legs straight. Allowing the blood to flow towards the head. So minimum two minutes, we hold the posture anywhere you hold. Even if you're not doing the headstand, you're getting partial benefits of the practice. By holding the posture midway.
Now, those who are comfortable in the head stand, let's go in for the variations. Separate the legs apart. Twist your body to the right. Twist the body to the left. Back to the center. Bring the legs together. Move one leg forward, other leg back. Switch your legs. Bring the legs together. Now bend the knees, join the soles together. Once again, twist to the right and twist to the left. Let's now try the scorpion, stretch the legs up or you can just bend the knees from here, place the hands close to the head, arch your back nicely, and then try to lift your head up. Those who are done with the head stand, please follow the steps, bend the knees, bring the knees to the chest and come down, relax into child's pose. Please sit up and relax in Shavasana. Turn the head side to side. Take rest, relax. Slowly bring your legs together, interlock your fingers, arms over the head when I stretch to the body. Release the stretch, get ready for the shoulder stand cycle. Arms close to the body, palms facing down, feet together, toes pointing up, chin to the chest, moving the shoulders down. Inhale, raise the legs and the trunk, come up, support your back into the shoulder stand. Once you're there, you can make the possible correction by bending the knees to the forehead, elbows a little more in, hands a little more down towards the middle back. <clears throat> and then you can straighten the legs whenever you're ready. Keep the buttocks lifted up, buttocks pushing towards the head. Body will shift it entirely to the shoulders. So that you can align the heels, the buttocks, and the shoulders. Try it. When you're comfortable, close the eyes and still the body for some time. Relax the facial muscles. Feel a strong block in the throat region. So any moment you are moving down towards the mat, make sure to lift up higher. Don't let that lock loosen. We are stimulating the thyroid and the thyroid gland by creating that pressure in the throat region. A few more breaths. Just be patient with your practice. Don't give up.
Lengthen up the body as you inhale. And on the exhalation, bring both your legs down over the head. Inhalasan, keep supporting the back. Now raise the right leg up, inhale. Keep supporting the back, please. Right leg up. Exhale down. Left leg up, inhale. Exhale down. One more time, inhale the right leg up. Exhale down. Inhale the left leg up. Exhale down. Now please settle down in Halasan. If you need to support the back, you can keep supporting the back or just stretch the arms on the mat. You can try interlocking the fingers and pulling the arms away from the body. That releases the pressure from the neck. Keep the tailbone lifted up, back straight, and knees pushed away from the forehead, toes walking in. Breathe slowly into the abdomen. Every breath massages stimulates the abdominal organs, so feel it. Working on the spinal column, on the hamstring, and on the abdominal organs. Support the back, inhale, come up into the shoulder stand. From here, those who can move down into the Setu Bansarvangasan, please bend the knees and lower the feet down one by one all together. If you cannot, just use your arms as breaks, release the legs over the head and release the posture very slowly. Now, hold the ankles and be up into the Setu Bandhasana, everybody. Keep the buttocks nicely lifted up, making the thighs parallel to the mat and chest very close to the chin. Feel that arch in the spine. Lift up higher. The moment you release the posture, you get plenty of blood flow to the spinal column to the vertebrae. Heels down. And slowly exhale, come down. Let's get ready for Chukrasin. Place the hands and the shoulders, fingers turned in. As you inhale, lift your buttocks and come up. Press the hands, try to lift up your buttocks higher so that the knees can straighten more. Elbow straight, hold it. 10, 9, 8, 7. Try, lift the right leg up or you can just keep holding chakras. Excellent, down, the left leg up. Down, <clears throat> right down, up. Touch the right thigh with your right hand. Down, and the left down. Slowly come down, release the posture. Hug the knees into the chest. Press the lower back down. On the exhalation, raise the head and chest, come up. Bring the chin, nose or forehead close to the knees with lower back down. Contract the abdomen. Try holding the opposite elbows, everybody. Breathe. And slowly exhale, bring the head down. Release the arms down, raise the legs, inhale up. With control, exhale, bring the legs down all the way. Let's give count the stretch after the shoulder stand. Arms under the body, shoulder blades together, hands stretching down, elbows nicely, and tucked under the body. Now head up, chest up. As you inhale, come up on the elbows and look to the toes. Lift your chest up, arch your back as you exhale, lower the head down on the mat. So instead of the back of the head, everybody try, make an effort, bring the top of the head down by pressing down on the elbows and keep the body on the body weight on the elbows. Make your breath slow, long and deep. Don't forget this. Every inhalation, the abdomen expands, chest expands. Every exhalation, abdomen contracts. Reach the breath, watch your breath reaching to the collarbones. And then again to the abdomen. Slowly 
Slowly inhale, raise the head and chest, come up, look at the toes. And exhale, release the body down. Release the arms from under the body, rotate the wrist, turn the head side to side and relax in Shavasana. Feel the relaxation through the upper body. Feel the lightness in the neck region. And feel the lightness in the mind. Slowly bring the legs together. Inhale, reach up with your arms, blocking the fingers, stretch your body, stretch the body, release the stretch and please sit up. Let's get ready for the Pashimutanasana. Stretch your legs forward, sit up straight, lengthen the arms up, lengthen up the body, stretch up. And as you exhale from the base of the spine, extend forward and reach down, hold the toes, if you cannot hold the toes, just hold wherever possible. It's important you relax the body and then the, then the body will automatically come down. Slow down, deepen the breath into the app. Completely let go in the mind, in the body after three to four breaths of adjustment. Slowly stretch forward, inhale and stretch up. Exhale, place the hands behind the body, lower the head back, out to stretch, incline plane. Inhale, lift your buttocks and come up. Right hand, put the hands down, injure the thumbs. Hold it 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and please come down. Relax on the abdomen. Make a pillow with your hands, turn the head to the right, big toes touching together, heels butt. Recharging the body with the breath, do not allow the mind to wander. The body will be tired if you don't focus on the breath. So breath is what makes difference between any kind of physical exercise and yoga. If you don't breathe consciously, mindfully, this practice becomes like a physical routine, physical exercise. Get ready for Bhujangasana. Place the forehead down, feet together, toes pointing back, elbows close to the chest, hands under the shoulders. As you inhale, raise the head and chest, come up into the cobra. Let's remove the hands off the mat for a while and understand how much is our strength of the back. Now you put the hands down without separating the elbows, without hunching the shoulders. And just put a little more pressure on the lower abdomen around the navel to lift your chest up. Don't use the shoulders, don't use the shoulders. No, no, don't use the shoulders. Just press on the abdomen and whatever you get is fine. Breathe. Slowly exhale, come down. Turn the head to the left, relax the body, breathe. Dhanur Asan, the bow pose, place the forehead down, bend the knees and hold your hands. As you inhale, raise the head up, chest up, knees up, thighs up, come up on the soft part of the abdomen. Keep pulling the legs up and the chest up, stretch the chin up, close your eyes and relax the face. 
Keep breathing. Feel a good pressure on the abdomen. Hold it. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Rock the body forward and backward three to four times. Don't drop the head down. Just move it on the abdomen. Creating more pressure on the abdomen as you rock the body. Stimulating the abdominal organs. Slowly release the posture. Place the hands under the shoulders. Come up on the knees and the hands for Majriyasa. Align the knees and the buttocks, wrist and the shoulders. Inhale, push the hip back, arch the back and stretch your chin forward. Exhale, round the back. Tuck the chin in, pull the abdomen in. One more time. Inhale, stretch. Exhale, round the back. Back to the neutral position. Stretch back into the child's pose. Knees together, arms extending forward. Forehead down. Please slowly come up into the inverted V. Inverted V. And bring the right foot forward between the hands. We'll do one more backward bend. That's Anjani Asan. Put the left knee down. Left toes pointing back. Left knee down. And push the left knee more back. Place the hands on the right thigh. First balance yourself properly. If you feel pressure on the left knee, you can put a cushion or hold the yoga mat under the knee. Arch your back, stretch your arms up. And arch back more. Look up to the hands. Arms can be parallel or you can join the hands in prayer. Keep pushing the pelvis down. Breathe. Hold it five, four, three, two, one, place the hands down now by the side of the right foot and stretch the right leg forward in Hanumanasan. Just try whatever is possible, hold it there. Stretch the right heel forward, right foot forward and move the hands back near the buttocks. Hands should be near the waist or the buttocks and try to push the pelvis down. So wherever you have reached, imagine there is a spring in the pelvis and you're pushing it up and down. Very good. Take your time and then move back into, take this leg, right leg back. Take your time. There's no hurry. And move back into the inverted V. Now bring the left foot forward between the hands for the Anjani Asana. Put the right knee down, right toes pointing back, push the right knee more back. And then place the hands on the left thigh, push the pelvis down. Reach up with your arms and arch back. Anjaniyasan. Excellent. Come up, everybody. Very good. Hold it. Five, four, three, two, one. Place the hands down. And let's stretch the left leg forward in Anjaniyasan. Oh, sorry. Hanumanasan. Do whatever is possible. And then wherever you reach, push the pelvis up and down. Imagine there's a spring in the pelvis. So try to straighten the back by moving the hands more back towards the buttocks. Excellent job. And when you think you're done enough, you can just draw the leg back and relax into the child's pose. Arms extending forward. Child's pose. Ajniyasan is a back wind, so it's a good idea to relax the body in Shashankasan for a while. Now please slowly sit up. We prepare for half spinal twist. Sit to the right side of your body. Bring the left foot across the right thigh. Place the left hand near the tailbone on the mat. Right arm up, inhale. Exhale, twist to the left, lean forward, push the outside of the left knee with your upper right arm and hold the ankle. Look to the left shoulder. 
you can just hug the knee if you cannot hold the ankle, nothing to worry. It gives similar benefits. Just create a good twist in the spine and feel inner pressure on the abdomen, that's it. Keep the chest open, facing forward to the wall. Shoulders in one straight line. Close your eyes. Inhale, raise the right arm and exhale, release it. Change the side, sitting to the left side of the body. Bring your right foot across the left thigh. Place the right hand behind, stretch the left arm, inhale, exhale, twist to the right, lean forward, pushing the outside of the right knee with your upper left arm. Hold the ankle and look to the right shoulder. Close your eyes, breathe, adjusting the body more if you're not feeling enough twist and enough contraction in the abdomen. Inhale, raise the left arm and exhale, bring it down. Hug the knees into the chest. Rest with forehead to the knees. Release the posture. Let's get ready for the grow pose. If you're still struggling with the grow, please place a cushion in front. Come up into the squatting position, making a rough square with your hands and the feet. Fingers slightly turned in if you are a beginner. And rest your knees on the upper arms. Look at a point ahead of the hands, lifting the buttocks trans with the body weight towards the hands. And the feet lift up. Very good. Excellent. Hold it at least for 15 pounds. And if you can hold longer, keep holding and come down whenever you have to. Slowly releasing the posture, please stand up. Standing forward bend, feet together, inhale, stretch the arms up. Lengthen up, exhale, lengthen the body forward and reach down for the ankles. Or hold behind the legs if you cannot reach the ankles, get the chest close to the thighs, hold it close to the knees, Padhasthasan, relax the toes, the space between the toes. Top of the head, reaching down, watch the shoulders and the neck muscles. You shouldn't be holding any tension in that region. Just let go in the upper body. Keep the knees straight. Slowly dangle the arms loose one vertebra at a time. Please come up. Giving a counter stretch, separate the feet, hip width apart, support your back, lower the head back and push the hip forward, breathe. Keep the knees straight. Inhale, slowly come up. Let's get ready for Parivrita Triponasan. Use the length of the mat, separate the legs, three and a half to four feet apart. Turn the right foot to the right. Now stretch your arms in line with the shoulders, inhale. As you exhale, twist your body to the left, uh, sorry, to the right and bring the left hand down, stretch the right arm up. Stay up and breathe. Align the arms, open the chest, look up to the hand, knees straight, breathe. Fetch that twist to the other side. Twist the body. Inhale, slowly come up. Take your own time. Find your balance. And then exhaling, twist to the other side. Bring the right hand down and the left arm up. Look up. Very good. Breathe. Breathe. 
Inhale, slowly come up. Exhale, bring the arms down. Join the legs together. Time for final relaxation. Please come to the front of the mat. Sit down and lie down. Bring your breathing back to normal. Let's do the tensing of the body parts. Raise your both legs two inches above the mat. Tense the legs, tense the legs and drop legs down. Squeeze the buttocks off the mat, tense the buttocks, tense, 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 and drop. Press the lower back to the back, press it down, release. Lift the chest up, up, and drop it down. Squeeze the shoulders into the ears. Push the shoulders down, raise the arms two inches above the mat. Clench your fingers tight around the thumbs, tighten the fist, tight, tight. Open the fingers, tense your arms, tense your arms, and drop. Make a tight face, squeezing all the facial muscles to the nose, tight, tight, let go. Open the mouth, stretch your tongue out, open the eyes wide and look at the forehead, stretch all the facial muscles, stretch, stretch, release, close the mouth. Moving the shoulders more down gently, turn the head to the right, try to touch the right ear to the mat, don't overdo with the neck muscles, back to the center and to the left. Back to the center, final adjustment to the body, moving the shoulders down, bring the chin close to the chest. Keep the arms six to eight inches away from the body, palms turned up and the fingers curled in. Legs comfortably apart, feet relaxed to the sides. Watch this adjustment and then mentally scan the body for any tension that's still there. Completely let go and we then move on the auto suggestion or suggesting the body parts mentally a good relaxation mentally relax the toes the soles the heels and the ankles relax the knees and the thighs Relax the buttocks, relax the hip joint. Completely let go in the legs, relax the legs and say to yourself, my legs are relaxed. Relax the abdomen and the chest. And bring the awareness to the back. Relax the lower back. The middle back. The upper back. Relax the shoulder blades. Relax the spinal column. Allow the relaxation to the back. Let the back sink down with gravity. Feel that relaxation. And say to yourself, my back is relaxed. Bring the awareness to the arms. Relax the fingers, palms and the wrists. Relax the forearms, the elbows, the upper arms. Relax the shoulders, the neck and the throat. Relax the chin, the jaw. Relax the ears, the cheekbones, the nostrils, soften the eyes and the forehead. Relax the top of the head, 
back of the head. Feel the lightness and the upper body just let go. Sit yourself, my arms, shoulders, leg, face and the head are relaxed. Moving the awareness deeper to the down your arms. Visualize each organ. Send the sailing wave of relaxation to the abdomen. And visualize a good relaxation to all the general organs in the abdomen. Relaxing the lungs. Relax the heart. Relax the brain. All the internal organs are healthy, relaxed and rejuvenated. All the body systems are functioning very well. The whole body is relaxed. The whole body is healthy. Finally, let go in the mind, relax the mind. Say to yourself, my body is relaxed, my mind is relaxed, my breath is calm and peaceful. I am completely relaxed. Relax, relax, relax. Bring the awareness back to the body, move the feet, move the hands, legs and the arms, very gently down on each side to side. Breathe more consciously, more deeply. Join the legs together, interlock your fingers, stretch your arms up, final gentle stretch to the body. Release the stretch, bend the knees, turn over. Take your time when you're ready. Please sit down for the final prayer. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
यजामहे सुगंधे पुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वाकमे वंदना मंगल सुखिन निरामया भद्रा पश्यु मचिपाकुवे अस्तो मगम तम सोमा ज्योतिर्गम शांति थैंक्स टू द मास्टर्स एंड थैंक यू